Warning, this video may contain foul language and mech on mech mayhem. Your discretion is advised. Welcome to Mech Warrior Online. This is Fuzzy Nova, and today we have the Corsair Broadside. I wanted to do a first impressions video, just run a match or two in it. Um, I'm not too sure what to do with this other than running Goss at first. Um, I've tried a few different builds, um, and I'm still trying to get the hang of it. I am. Uh, I like the mech. I like this mech quite a bit. I like the design. Of course, it's a junkyard mech made from junkyard pieces, which is kind of cool. It's kind of like a you know like a pirate mech. It's a it's a pirate mech. Yeah, that's what it is. Um, but the broadside, uh, yeah, most of us probably got this for free today. Um, so there's going to be a lot of these running around for the next couple weeks. And um, so yeah, Charlie Lance is going to be insane for a while. Um, don't be surprised if you see, you know, a whole lance of these. Anyways, other than um, running Goss rifles on this, because that's what it comes with, and it does come with a, a Goss cooldown quirk along with a ballistics quirk, um, I'm going to try that first, and then uh, I'll do another video on, on, I'm thinking maybe an LBX build with the pulse lasers, because, you know. I, I like using Goss rifles sometimes, but usually it's heavy Goss. I mean, Goss rifles are great weapons, and the cooldown on this is pretty pretty kick-ass. So that's what we're gonna do t in today's video. And I'm just trying to get the hang of this mech because it's it's kind of uh, I'm not sure. It's kind of hit or miss for me. Even though I like it, I've just the matches I've played in it have just been less than average. Um, and that could be uh, for a number of reasons. It could be, uh, you know, there's so many people playing right now. Uh, you know, every match is heavy as hell. And there's a mixture of new maps out. There are, you know, they got the old Frozen City. They got the old Forest Colony. They got Forest Colony at night. Or, I'm sorry, the, the Snow Forest Colony. They might even have the night one too. I don't know. I've seen like four different new maps today. Did they bring back the old Caustic? I'm not sure. I haven't played it yet. Um, I, I'm pretty sure they would though, but yeah, there's a lot of new maps, and I'm, <laughs> you know, you don't if you don't play a map for like three years, you kind of forget what you know uh, what's on it. So that's a mixture of a bunch of things, and uh, we're just gonna go ahead and play it anyways. Um, okay, so it's a 95 ton inner sphere assault mech. The broadside has two ballistic, three energy, and three missiles, and two AMS. This right here is just what I've been throwing together. This is one of my uh, many builds that I have for this so far. Uh, we're gonna go with the dual gauss rifles, which the mech actually comes with, but we're gonna keep those on. I did take them off, but I ended up putting them back on pretty quickly because uh, the build I was using wasn't working. And this build right here is just kind of, I just wanna go play a match kind of deal, you know what I mean? So I got two gauss rifles. <clears throat> it does come with a, a gauss cooldown of minus 10% and a ballistic uh, cooldown of minus 10%. It also comes with a minus 10% missile spread. But really, the only missile we're using is a little tiny SRM4, and that's just because I had an extra ton left. Um, so two gauss rifles, two large lasers. I'm going with the longer range build here because the Corsair has has um, giant torsos. So the hitboxes on this are uh, pretty easy to hit. Um, this is not like the build that I'm saying, hey, do this one. This is just me playing around. I'm just showing you what I have here. I got four tons of Goss ammo, um, two large lasers, SRM4, two Goss. Uh, I do have a targeting computer in my right torso. Double heat sinks, feral fibers. Um, if I'm going to go for Indo still, most likely when I do my LBX build. But this one, really, I mean, Heat management's good, and that's the big thing with this. I want my heat management to be pretty good, so it's 1.49 out of 2. Um, I do have a light engine. This mech comes with an XL, so make sure to take that out. Um, go light. I got a light 295, so my speed is about 50 kph. Armor points are really high in this. 112 CT, 71 torso, 64 arms, and I dropped it down to about 60 in my legs. So we do have that. Um... But for most builds, you're probably going to go Indo Steel um, for most of them. But Feral Fibers does give you extra protection. Also, when you're in the cockpit, I don't know if this is a bug or not, but um, or if it's just me. 
but your war horns, the one on the right side, is upside down. I'm guessing they meant to do that? Um, not sure though. Not sure. Alright, let's go ahead and just jump into a match, and I'll see you guys on the battlefield. We are on HPG Manifold. We've got the Corsair with us. Oh yeah, free mech. Everyone loves a free mech. First impressions, it's pretty good. I like it a lot. It does come with a nice uh, Gauss cooldown and ballistic cooldown. But this is not really what I want to do with it. Um, I'm just doing this to see how it performs. Um, I got a couple Goss quirks as well from the skill tree, but yeah, I'm still working on this baby here. But um, I mean, it can take a, it can dish out some damage. I'm just trying to find that perfect build for me, you know, I'm trying to get that that perfect one and. Uh, Yeah, they got a fleet nice. 20 over there, right. too. New target acquired. We're looking around E3 area. I think an LBX build with yeah, some got a pulse lasers would be really nice. Atlas. I wish I could put LB20s on this thing. I'm sure can you can on all the other variants, the standard ones, but this one... Oh, we got an Atlas. Ooh, Echo. I'm sorry. Not Echo. Charlie's going down. Oh, Charlie Corsair CT. I need to check my eyesight. New target acquired. Well, at least we have the high ground. Um, now I can take some some shots here. There you go. There's Echo. CT, getting that CT right there, and oh yeah, that goss shot ripped right through him. Oh god, yeah, I love that shit. Juliet, uh, assassin, uh, yeah, not worth my time. All right, let's move over to this left here. Okay, guys, we have some uh, max moving around that uh, ramp. Four Let's lines left side. Doing that. Oh yeah, get back. Oh yeah, nice. Such a nice kill. All right, looks like the <laughs> they're moving around that corner pretty quick. I can assault them trying to chase me around the left hand side. Goss rifles can definitely get that that kill. That's that's for damn sure. Foxtrot, let's go for him. Oh yeah. All right, let's go for yeah. Huh? Mm, you know, there's a there's a yeah. Let's go for it. The old Timby right there. Pop him in the chest. Oh damn it! Damn it! Damn it! That that wall. Oh no! Oh, I could have got him. Damn. Now it is slow. Um, even though I upgraded my engine a little bit, it's still slow. 50 kph is is, is uh, sluggish. There we go, Delta. Oop. Let's go for that Timby. Let's grab him. Oh no way! Ooh, 500 damage. Dead even. What do we got? Oh shit. Oh man, that one had to hurt. Ouch. Uh oh, annihilator. Oh, I've just got my large laser. Just three left, guys. Five of you. 
push on him. Just my large Annihilator CT. It's a fun mech to play, it really is. I wish I could do another match, but I only have time for one right now. Uh, but if you have this, I mean, using Gauss Rifles is, is really a good way to go, since it does have those those cooldown quirks. It's just going to make them shoot so much faster. Um, but I'm definitely going to find that build that I want to do. And we totally raped them. Totally raped them. Very quick video today, but uh, yeah, just the first impressions. Good and job, it's, nice it's I like it. I think there's something here. Um, and this is just the, the free version. But we did pretty good. We got four kills. We did over 600 damage. Um, I'm going to try to do better. Um, I know this thing can do better. And it's I kind of used an odd build, so, you know, that's me using weird builds. Anyways, um, yeah, the next video will probably be the LBX um, Pulse Laser build, and that one should be really good. Guys, have a good rest of your day. We'll see you on the next video here shortly. And uh, see you next time. Fuzzy Nova out.